Hello guys. Today, I'll show you how to download the latest Velocity Executor, along with UNC score test and script execution performance in Blocks Fruits. So make sure to watch till the end, and don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the bell icon for more updates. Let's learn how to download Velocity Executor. First, visit the getvelocity.org website and go to the download page where you'll find three download links for the Velocity ZP file. Once downloaded, you'll get a zip file containing all the necessary Velocity Executor files. Now, extract the ZP file and open the Velocity folder. Before running the Executor, navigate to the Fixes folder. First, install the CertX file, and after that, install DirectX 10, which is required for Velocity Executor. Next, install Visual C++, choosing the 64-bit or 32-bit version, based on your processor type. After installing these dependencies, open the velocity.exe file and as you can see, it's working perfectly. Next, launch Roblox using Fishstrap. And once you're in the base plate, open Velocity Executor. First, select the client inside Velocity, then hit the inject button. Now, Velocity Executor is successfully attached. Next, open the console by typing forward slash console then paste the UNC score check script inside Velocity Executor and hit Execute. As you can see, the UNC score of Velocity Executor is an impressive 98%, which is awesome. Now, let's check the script execution performance of Velocity Executor. Once you're in Blocks Fruit, simply paste the script and hit Execute. As you can see, the script has loaded successfully and is working perfectly. Also, make sure to select the correct client before using it. I've added the Velocity Executor download link in the video description, so check it out. If you're still facing any issues, don't forget to comment below.